while sea ice in the Arctic Ocean at the top of the world was steadily melting, Antarctica's ring of floating ice was steadily growing until 2014. In just three years, as of 2017, it reached its 40-year record low, and that was 10.7 million square kilometers. So altogether, in that period of three years, it lost to a little over two million square kilometers of ice. And that's a little bit larger than the area of Mexico. More than three and a half decades of Antarctica's ice game vanished in just three years, melting more rapidly than what's happening in the Arctic. The scientific consensus is that the loss of Arctic sea ice is related to both air and seawater getting warmer. Researchers are still looking for an explanation for the dramatic decline in Antarctica. After 2014, when this huge decrease happened, there are some attempts to try to relate it to something going on in the atmosphere or the oceans. And there have been some indications that maybe like in the Weddell Sea, it could have been warm air coming in from the north and in the uh, Ross Sea, it might have been slightly different reasons. Whatever the reason, the trend has far-reaching yeah. implications for the polar ecosystem and the Earth as a whole. Unlike the bright, reflective surface of ice, dark ocean water absorbs sunlight, trapping heat and leading to a cycle of continuous warming. Scientists are still doing research in Antarctica, looking for explanations and solutions. Faith Lapidus, VOA News.